Hi, um, my name is Gareth Banks. I'm the Head of Sustainability here at Orange Box and uh, I'm going to do a very quick video, video for you today just to demonstrate how easy it is to upgrade or change or to remove the, uh, the style of arm that's on our uh, recur range of task chairs. Um, we do have two slightly different um, uh, designs of arm for the recur chair. We have the standard height adjustable arm uh, uh, but we do have one that's slightly more sophisticated as well that has a depth adjustable pad. So something that may well happen, and it, and, it, and it does happen from time to time, is a customer will buy a chair with the height adjustable arms and then decide that they, maybe they've got a few users that would benefit from having the depth adjustment on the pad as well. The depth adjustment is great for when you want users that do like to get tucked in very close um, to the desk because you can push the arm pad a little bit further rearward and that allows you to get a little bit closer. Um, it's very handy for at the end of the day as well when you just want to tidy your chairs away. So if I wanted to swap from this style of arm to this style of arm, it's very, very simple. Again, this is from a sustainability point of view. We want all of our chairs to be as easily upgradable as possible over time. But as and when we come out with new uh, innovations, which might not be a whole chair, it might just be an element of the chair. Uh, so we want things that are, are dead easy uh, to, to upgrade um, without having to bring the chairs back to Orange Box as well. So all I need to do this today is one five millimeter Allen key. And I will just carefully flip the chair onto its side so you can see uh, the recur chair of course is extraordinarily light so it's dead easy to do it's only uh, 12 and a half kilos um, and here you can see there's just a single fastener that holds that um, arm nicely in place now these have been torqued up on our production line so we'll need a bit of a twist but it's not so much that i can't overcome that um, all i need to do simply and easily is to remove the fastener slide the arm pad off you'll notice that there is this um, slide engagement so even if this the, even if the fastener fell out accidentally which we, it would never do because it has a thread lock patch on it um, this this the arms will never actually come off so you, all i need to do is to slide that arm out and slide the new arm in yeah then i just replace the fastener we do also have uh, a, width, a width adjustment kit as well, which is a slightly more sophisticated version of this fastener. It has a little turn knob on it as well. Um, so if you wanted to be able to width adjust while you were sat in the chair, um, you can upgrade to the width adjustable kit as well. Um, so there you can see how easy it is to remove the arms altogether if you just decide that you don't want them, or as I'm doing now is to upgrade to a slightly more sophisticated arm. All I would do is get it to the position roughly the position I want it to be at. You can change this over time, of course, it's very easy to do if you've not quite got it quite right. And then do the fastener up again. Now you don't want this coming out, so you want this fastener done up nice and tight. You don't have to go too crazy. I'm putting a few newtons of force through there. I'm comfortable that that's okay. It feels nice and tight. It's as simple as that. Okay, if I was doing this for real, of course, I'd put the same style of arm on the other side as well. There we go, ready to go.